YouTube, what's up? We are back at the mansion, of course. So we find our way home, I guess. And now it is time to talk about a new update. So most of the time on this channel, I'm gonna make updates or guides. So I have new, I do have time now to make my tier list and my Google Doc as well. I'm still working on it and it's not really close to be ready because I'm doing all my tier list, but I'm gonna start making those tier lists and those guides now. I don't think there is anything to do when it comes to the game. Uh, we don't really have any new updates. Classic is still the same. Endless is still the same. I mean, of course, we have some additions left and right, but there is no rework. So all my old guides are still quote unquote working, right? So um, there you go. So now I'm gonna attack tier list. That's the, the next plan. But today we are gonna talk about classic. It is easier now, a bit easier. And I'm gonna explain to you why, if you don't understand exactly why. So let's get into it. But first, subscribe if you are here for the second time and like the video. All right, so we are now in the Pokerog commit or, you know, commit, yeah, actually the commit menu here. And we have a couple of changes. So let's talk about them right now. Actually, we don't really need to go on those uh, pull requests, but as you can see, we have Parental Bond in the game now. It's a pretty cool thing, but it is gonna be mainly this one, general item weight adjustments. And this one here, quick adjustments to rock tier items. So we're gonna go into the Discord right now. And I'm gonna go on my Discord because they are over there, of course. So I made some updates. Every time there is an update, I'm posting it on my Discord with a roll notification if you want to check. But those are gonna be the balance change. So why am I saying that Classic is now quote unquote easier? Well, we have an adjustment when it comes to items overall. Like most items, you can find TM more easily. Right, so if you're looking for protect, or if you're looking for like um, I don't know anything, right, for your main Pokemon, you can find them. It's actually easier to find them now because all the items like Ultra Ball, uh, Rock Ball, and all those items are lowered. Right, so everything else goes up in the pool. Okay, for example, we have this one as well. This is a pretty big one, the form change item. It was adjusted from 18, so it was fixed. Right. To a variable. So technically, it is nerfed early game, right? So as you can see here, 5 for 150, 10 for 51, 100, 15, etc. Uh, etc. Et so it is actually better at after 151, which is where the game gets a bit harder because we have the evil team leader at 165, we have the elite 4, we have all of that, right? So at 151, if you get so at this point, most of the time you're gonna get your, um, I think I saw a change somewhere, yeah, your Mega Bracelet and Dynamax Band, you're gonna have them at this point. So I'm gonna talk about this after, but let's talk about those first. So Vouchers were nerfed, but we're gonna talk, again, they're gonna be changed a bit later. So they were nerfed because it is way easier to farm Vouchers in Endless, of course. So as you can see here, Voucher Plus reduced from 5 to 3 which means they are actually gone after two rerolls instead of three. And it says Voucher Maxing is too strong. Voucher's were nerfed. That's just one thing I want to talk about. But the fact that Rock Ball are lowered, it's lowering the pool of items overall. And this means that it's easier to find items like the form change and the this one here, the, the Mega Bracelet Dynamax Band. So it's easier to find form items in Classic. This is why it's technically easier now because it is easier to find TMs, it is easier to find form changes, uh, form items, etc, etc. That's basically it. The quick low was moved to ultra tier, which is the yellow tier. And uh, now if we pass those, so nothing else besides that. So of course, the fact that Rock Ball are lower, it is easier to get super XP charm as well. So they are nerfed, but since everything else is nerfed, the pool is lower. So there is more chance of finding the super XP charm. Again, classic is easier, for sure. You're gonna find those form change items more often. And now, let's talk about this uh, rock tier item adjustments. As you can see, the Voucher Plus weight increased from 3, 2 descending per reroll until 0, to 3, 1 descending per reroll until 0. So they actually kind of, quote unquote, reverted this thing here. Where is it? This one. So instead of rerolling two times now, you have to reroll three times, but the weight is lower. Because the weight of the rock ball is lower, because everything is lower, you have more chance of finding them, right? So now 
we have a weight of three, but it descends uh, by one for each reroll. You can reroll three times and then you can find it anymore. All right, makes sense. So it was five to zero. Now it's three to zero and losing one per reroll. That's it. Now, Super XP Charm was nerfed again. And as you can see here, ended up being way too common. So this is what it means. Because everything is lower, because the roll pool is lower, because everything is lower, we can find those Super XP Charms more often. And those, if you don't know, EXP is king in this game. It's, it's king in Endless at the, or in the early game parts. It is king in Classic. If you are at the level cap, it is very strong. All of those are very strong. So this means that now the Mega Bracelet and Dynamax Band change from 8 minimum, so 8, then 16, then 24, then 32, to 9, 18, 27, 36. After that, so, as you can see, we have a buff for the form, the form change items, which means from 5 minimum, 10, 15, 20, to 6, 12, 18, uh, yes, 18, 24. So this is a 24 weight at 151. There is a way higher chance of you finding a form item in Classic now. And this is why I mean that Classic got quote unquote easier is because those items are just, are just going to be more common now. If you don't know how the weight work, you can go on the wiki. You go into items. You go into the weight. So this is full items in pool and weight. And you go into rock pool. Once you are in the rock pool here, if you want to calculate the chance of an item appearing in the shop, one, I'm going to take my calculator here. And uh, so if you take any items now, let's say you are at 151 for your form change item. You want to take the 24 and divide it by the maximum or the minimum. What I take is take the average, like a bit, um, a bit above the average. So do 214 plus 62 divided by 2 plus like 30 just to get a bit above the average and then you do 24 divided by 168 oh, sorry divided 168 there you go so there is a 0.14% chance of this item appearing in the shop it is not that high of course but it is still a greater chance than it was before now there is something you take into account for endless and stuff like this. If an item has a max stack, you can once you get to this stack, you cannot find them anymore. So it is the case for general item like a super XP charm. They don't go on Pokemon. They go at the top left on the general items. So once you have 30 super XP charm, you cannot find them anymore. And then they actually remove from the pool. This way there is a minimum area maximum here. And this is why the maximum is so high, is because there is a lot of form change item as well. Okay? So basically, what I'm saying for this update is that it is going to be easier, technically, to find XP Charm, which are great, form change items, and those are all going to make Classic easier. So now I would say, for the suggestions, always try to take at least one Pokemon that can Dynamax, one Pokemon that can Mega Evolve, and then you can have one of those two forms for your late game, which is after 151. All right, so there you go. That's going to be it for me. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.